What is up everybody? Hope everyone is doing well. Um, recently, I wore this hat right here. It was one of my favorite hats to wear. And uh, it was a tragic um, tragic ending for it. Well, it's not ending, but tragic stains on it, I should say. I played basketball in it and it fell off my head and it got stomped on. But uh, I'm going to show you guys how to fix it. I got all kinds of stains on the front and the sides and on the sweat band from just sweating and using it a lot. So let's head inside and get the ingredients. Alright, so we got the hat right here. As you can see, the brim and a little bit up on the upper is uh, stained up with some mud or dirt, whatever we got on there. And then on the side, there's just a few little things. <clears throat> the back is pretty bad. But that's what happens when you use a hat. And it's white, so, you know, it's going to get dirty. So the first thing we got is OxyClean laundry stain remover. You don't have to use OxyClean. All you have to do is have a stain remover. And then we got some Dawn... Uh, Dawn dish soap. You can use any kind of dish soap and then get a uh, a container of some sort because You're gonna have to put the hat inside the container. So make sure it fits inside all right, so I'm gonna really just Spray down this hat where the uh, the stains are Just get it all over it and you really just want to soak this, soak this in the stain remover. You can even rub it in if you want, into the darker spots that have a lot more uh, stain on it. Alright, now just set it down in the bucket. I need to rinse my hands, but what you're going to do, I'm dripping on the floor over here, you're going to use your dish soap and you're going to, Whip it around in there real quick. There's not too much in there. Not too little. Don't put too much or else it's going to suds up way too much. Alright, then you're going to take your bucket with all your ingredients in it. Ah, you're going to want a clean sink to do this in. Now I'm going to just pour like warm water. Not too warm. That's probably a good enough amount of water. Ah! I need to rinse off my hand real quick. Now here comes the hard part. What you gotta do is put it in, I like to put it in the corner so nobody messes with it. And now you leave it there for 24 hours. And you're gonna let all that stain remover really soak into the hat and then I will show you guys what you do after that tomorrow luckily for you guys this video will be cut and you want to watch 24 hours of that thing soaking all right it has been over 24 hours <clears throat> let's just slide this oh it's a light so you can see it <clears throat> So basically you're gonna have like a little bit of dirt in the water and it's been soaking so some of the stains might be like a little bit out but it's gonna make it a whole lot easier when we do the next process. I like to dip it a couple times just to get all the stuff out. All right, let's carry this to the tub. Alright, so the next step, you're going to want an old toothbrush, but make sure, um, make sure the bristles aren't too dirty. And then you're going to want your stain remover again. And then you're going to 
take your hat and you only soak your hat like overnight like that if it's like really deep stains if they're not really deep stains and you can always just skip this step and it usually works as long as like a surface stain but if it's on um, if it's on um if it's really deep then it's not the work and uh, as you can see these stains are coming straight out of the hat that part's all white i'll show you with the uh strap because this is pretty dirty it's a little bit lighter than what it was though because it's soaked so i'm gonna spray it and then scrub it look at that all the stains are out so i'm basically just gonna go around the whole hat looking for stains and I'm gonna go over them real quick with the toothbrush. Alright, so after you are done um, scrubbing it with the toothbrush, you just really want to rinse off, rinse off the whole hat. I'm save warm water. Make sure it has all the, the stuff off of it. So we have it all rinsed off, and then all you gotta do is hang it up to dry. And this is gonna this is gonna take overnight to dry. So you won't be able to wear your hat for <clears throat> two days, but it's definitely worth it because then your hat's gonna look brand new. So I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope this helps some of you guys. Oh my gosh. Uh, <clears throat> but as I was saying, I hope it helps some of you guys. And uh hope you guys had a good morning, a good evening, and a good night. Adios, amigos. <laughs>